What's up, guys? The old name runs back. We're going to do another video. Um, let's talk about Rattlegram. Um, so, uh, old, I say old friend. We're, we're, we're acquaintances, you know, internet acquaintances. It's a good guy, uh, Bill at Stoker Medic. Um, did, a, did a comms video. Uh, that was less than a week ago. And he did a good job of it. And I'll, I'll throw a link in the description box below. If I know how to, if I can figure out how to do a card, we'll do that. Um, but, uh, so what? Sorry, sorry. Now I got got my buddy Mr. Extreme over there getting excited to play some Rattlegram. So, um, just like if you want your kids to eat vegetables, teach them to grow vegetables, right? So he's out there geeking over geeking over Rattlegram. It's fun. It's just it's uh, just a supplement. It's just another tool in the tool bag, tool in the tool belt. You know, another magazine in the pouch. However you want to look at it. Um, and I think it's it it's not known as it's overlooked. So. So we're going to be playing some Rattlegram. And, uh, so, all right, guys, so let's get to it. What is Rattlegram? So we're going to talk about Rattlegram first. So. What is Rattlegram? Well, it is the beta of Ribbit Radio. You can see the top, ribbitradio.org. Um, so Ribbit Radio Rattlegram is a digital text messaging mode for HF, VHF, and UHF recreational and emergency communications. Um, I just feel like I need to note the recreational part has not been there. Um, and it is now, and I agree, because I think the, the developers of this are realizing they're onto something. Um, uh, digital messaging... Um, there's no hardware. The video, or the phones you see me and uh, Mr. Extreme using in this video are old, old Android phones. Okay. Uh, there's no SIM card. There's no connection to data. We took them to Wi-Fi, put Rattlegram on them, and we are able to do this. Um, uh, the, it's a redundant distribution right here. Um, it's it's very robust. You you if if the ball hasn't completely dropped and you know that kind of thing, um, you're able to do a short video looking at some cats and just throw something in there. You can communicate. Okay, um, it it will not be the 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 signal and the the uh, data in it will not be lost through all the compression as you upload and it comes through all the, it, it's really, really, really robust. It's freaking amazing. Um, so, and, uh, rivet, it's open source guys. I am not the guy. I'm not a software guy. I really can't explain to you, even as a ham radio operator, how this works. It does work though. Um, so, but if you are that guy and this is a worldwide, uh, effort their end goal uh, really and it goes back to an emergency communications up here um, they want to be able to have a fema form or whatever country form on your phone you fill in the blanks you hit send it goes for less than a second and you send your information it's freaking awesome um, the one well, the one catch and it is a bit of a pain is you got to have you know the the radio and the phone together do that acoustic coupling um, it, so but other than that this is I don't know this is an, uh, an amazing to me at least and I, I think I'm right um, uh, tool for the tool bag tool for the tool belt again that extra magazine in your magazine pouch so there you go guys so rivetradio.org if you want to learn more and if you are one of those smart people that like to play with code and stuff reach out guys if you think you can help i i can't say they'll accept you but i don't know why they wouldn't all right guys let's talk about some legal stuff so not an attorney i'm just an old nimrod but the government likes its codes, its laws, or it's got to have that control. The links directly from the government will be in the description box below. I can't remember the big long, whatever. Down there reading yourself. Ham radio. Pretty much anything is legal except just trying to encrypt it or that kind of thing. Uh, Go from the ham. Um, FRS. If you're wondering what we're using, these are Bofang BF88 STs. Uh, just little FRS radios. I think. I think I got a pack of four for like 35, 40 bucks. 
Um, one thing I don't like about them, they got uh, don't have a way to use uh, double A's or triple A's. Uh, GMRS radios, one second data burst for positional re reporting or uh, texting well, under that one second data burst, legal as I read it over FRS and GMRS and HAM, HAM does its thing. Um, MERS CB, best time reading it, no bueno. Okay, well the FCC's catch you, but if you want to keep your nose clean, just know it's not legitimate. Um, so there you go, guys. Again, the links below. Go read it directly from your government and uh, do it as you want. Hey, blueberry. I'm sorry, carrot. This is blueberry. You copy? Yes, I did copy blueberry. Uh, you prepared the copy. Yes. Blueberry. Right. <laughs> I am sending. Stand by. information you have to send to me. Go ahead. I don't have any. Make something up that's clean and appropriate. I don't want to have it appropriate and clean. Right. What is your favorite type of pizza? <laughs> Are you ready? I am ready. Go ahead and send. Uh, cue us out on the uh, anchovy pizza. <laughs> I need pepperoni. Hit the button first. Wait half a second to a second, and then talk. Go ahead. Thank you. Uh, received all. Stand by. How are you? God bless America, sir. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I appreciate you helping, Mr. Extreme. Uh, Mr. Super Size Extreme. We're talking to the camera. No, don't drink yet, man. <laughs> All right, guys. This is the old Nimrod. This is Mr. Extreme. What do you want to tell people? Drive safe. Drive safe. That works, guys. <laughs> uh, cheers, by the way. Well, actually, we'll save the cheers for a second. So, the old Nimrod, my closing. Peace, 7 3. God bless you guys. Be good humans. Mr. Extreme, the old Nimrod. Blueberry, Mr. Carrot, we are QRT. Cheers. Hi. And also, um, don't drive, don't walk on the road. <laughs>